You have loot. Loot crate, that is. Hello, everybody. It's Sephiroth Level 4 for another loot crate unboxing. This time it's for uh, March's loot crate. I believe the theme is covert. Apparently, people are saying, like, this is the best one they've ever gotten. I'll have to see. I've been getting this for a while. So let's open it up. Love this thing. There's a lot of stuff in here. Oh, wow. They put the badge on the very top this time. Uh, Loot Crate March. It's, yeah, it's like spy stuff. That's pretty nice. Let's put that over there. <laughs> the, um, I'll show you the box afterwards. It's like a keyboard over here. Seems to have some sort of code on it. Okay. Um, so I guess we'll take this apart piece by piece. First, the shirt, which is, seems to be a James Bond type of thing. <laughs> the shirt says, this is stirred. If you don't get that, it's because in the James Bond movies, he always orders a vodka, marti vodka martini, shaken, not stirred. So, this is stirred. You ruined the vodka martini. So, this could be fun. This could be fun to wear. I like this. It's a big shirt. It's actually white for once. It's a different material than normal, but that's okay. I think that they just get the shirts made by different people. There's a lot of stuff in here. Oh, man. Oh, man. Mad Libs. Oh, God. Oh, man. I haven't, I haven't bought a new Mad Libs in over 10 years, probably. No, actually, we've probably gotten one sooner because we played Mad Libs when my brother was younger. But when I was in fifth grade, when I was in fifth grade, I went to a school in um, in Manhattan, you know, New York City. Um, and Mad Libs was like the biggest thing there. Uh, I actually still have the Mad Libs that I did in, in fifth grade with my best friend Dove and uh, a few that I did with uh, my friend Rita. And... Um, it was so fun. It was so fun. So, yeah, Mad Libs, the word's greatest word game. Super silly way to fill in the plural noun. Boats! Aardvarks! I love filling in aardvarks. Ah, uh, Price Stern Sloan. I love you guys. Um, but yeah, if you've never played Mad Libs, essentially it's something like this, where you have one person who's like, okay... Plural noun, and then, like, you go around to all the other people. Okay, say plural noun. You know, uh, aardvark. Okay, you, adjective. Slow. Okay, person in room male. Dovey. Okay, number. Three billion. Adjective. Fat. Noun. Computer. Essential, etc., etc., etc. Part of the body. Earlobe. And uh, just all sorts of things. And then once you're done, and you write it in, obviously. And once you're done, you uh, then read it out. You know, the Spy Hall of Fame honors the brave aardvarks of that slow profession known as spying. Induc uh, spying. Inductees include Dovey Bond, famously known as Agent 003 Billion. This spy was as handsome as he was fat. Not only did he bond nab the bad laptop every time, he always won the earlobe of the green woman as well. So yeah. Um, and if you're playing by yourself, it gives you a thing up here so you don't spoil the story. And you fill it in, and as you go in, you're like, okay. So, and there's, you know, many of them, and it goes on. And they this thing entertained us in long car rides and everything, and good stuff. Oh man, I miss playing Mad Libs now. <laughs> okay, what do we have next over here? We have a something. This looks like a uh, necklace clip. Necklace uh, for a uh, an ID badge. This smells like a shoe store. You know, like a new shoe smell. You know the smell. If you've ever been to a shoe store, they all smell the same. This smells like a shoe store. Maybe because it's made out of shoelace. <laughs> I don't know. Actually, this is more like um, parachute string. Actually, no, this could be shoelace. Uh, got a... Uh, this is parachute string. Some sort of bracelet with a Loot Crate logo. That's pretty cool. We'll put it on, too. Why not? Why? Why not? Why not? Uh, but yeah, these are pretty cool. 
I don't know what the point of it is. I think it's like if you go into a horrible situation, there's actually some sort of way to use the parachute string, but it just looks cool otherwise, I guess. I don't know if it actually has a use. Let's see if I can actually clip this on with one hand. Or if it actually fit around my wrist, because I happen to be a large person. I don't know if you if you knew that, or if the mad cli uh, mad clips mad libs clued you into that fact. I smell like a shoe store now. Um, but yeah, it's actually pretty nice. Just fits around my wrist. This smells like a shoe store, also. You can quote me on that. This smells like a shoe store. Sephiroth Total Four, 2015. I don't know what it means. What does that mean? Uh, a stealth wristwatch. No one gets to see the time. Uh, press the face to display the time. Oh man, that is cool. I like this. Uh, let's, uh, I mean, it, I'm not gonna wear it because I have like the best watch ever. It's on like a thing and this watch has lasted me God knows how many years at this point. We only had to change the battery once, but stealth wristwatch. Essentially, to find out the time, you press the face. Isn't that cool? The time is wrong, but I'm pretty sure you could change that on your own. That is cool. I like it. I like it a lot. We are not going to wear it, but that will, that will definitely be something that I show off to people. And I'm not throwing this out because it actually tells me how to change the time, so that's good. Uh, one sec. Just need to blow my nose. Next, we have Field Notes. 48 page memo book. Durable materials made in the USA. So, yeah, we have two Loot Crate exclusive. <laughs> Classified. To be unsealed by authorized personnel only. <laughs> I'm giving myself the authorization. So, yeah, this is essentially just a, uh, a notebook, like a personal notebook, but apparently it's made out of good material, so it'll actually last. For you to put in a jacket pocket or something, you know? So that's nice. Got an Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Loot Crate exclusive EFX collectible. I have no idea what that's supposed to mean. But it's some sort of card or something. Let's open this up. And inside we ha oh, okay. We have an ID badge. I'll read this in a moment, but here we go. I am now an agent of S.H.I.E.L.D. apparently, and I smell like a shoe store. Marvel's Agent of S.H.I.E.L.D. S.H.I.E.L.D. Lanyard. Yeah, that's the what I'm wearing. The principle of S.H.I.E.L.D. was founded upon pure, uh, 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 fa was founded upon was pure. Protection, one word, sometimes, okay, whatever. Nick Fury, season one, the beginning of the end. Blah, 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 pure ideals, blah, blah, blah. So this is apparently a official prop replica of Billy Koenig, Pat, Pat Oswalt's lanyard. I have a feeling that I'm going to have some sort of use for this. Um, certifies a accompanying collectible is an authentic replica produced by EFX. Replicated using the original data files that were used to make the screen used prop and extensive reference photos. That's really cool. High quality materials, finished by hand. Uh, so yeah, this is an exact replica of the lanyard that we that the guy used. Apparently, he smelled like a shoe store. <laughs> um, so yeah, cool stuff. I'm gonna hold on to this too. Actually, I think I put this on backwards. I'll put this on backwards. Anyway, whatever. Okay, we got it. I'm an official Shield agent, and there ain't nothing you can do. Get a free download of Ninjak Number One. I guess it's a, um, some sort of ninja comic. For more paracord action, I guess this is a paracord, you know, parachute cord. Top secret, Agent 1337, you know, Agent Lee, get it? Your mission, should you choose to accept it, will have you traveling through uncharted wilderness in the redacted region of redacted. In this package, you'll find a paracord survival bracelet. They're available exclusively to agents of loot. That's my organization, Loot. So it may draw some attention, but it's more than just fashionable. It's made of military-grade parachute cord and it could actually save your life. 
Oh yeah, see, you can un you can unwrap it. Para uh, paracord survival bracelet can make a tourniquet, build a snare, be used as a fishing line, and more. So yeah, unwrap your paracord, lay it down flat, locate locate the glued section of the cord, pull it apart. So essentially, like if you're going camping or something, it's good to wear this because aside from the fact that it looks nice. Um, you can pull it apart and use it for a whole bunch of stuff and military grade parachute cord actually is really useful because it will not come apart So if you need a if you get like a cut and you need a tourniquet tourniquets You know, like those things when you take a blood test and they wrap it around your arm to staunch the blood flow Things like that or you know if you want to use it as a, a garret Around you know to choke somebody to death. I do not recommend that or condone it um and finally, what we get here is Loot Crate Exclusive Orphan Black. I have no idea who that is, but I guess I'll read this later. Sarah. And uh, show you the inside of this. There's like a code thing and the little keyboard and encrypted name and a URL. And so I think I got an email from Loot Crate that there's like a whole like secret easter egg hunt that they're making us do for this uh, so here's the front of the loot crate thing that's pretty cool uh, covert so yeah uh, just drink a martini shaken not stirred yes yeah, so your covert status has been compromised and we cannot send backup we were able to get you this loot crate before your contact line went dark I hope they don't disavow me enclosed you will find all the tools necessary to get back to HQ with not only your life but with valuable intel intact as well the odds are against you, but with the correct tools and your sharpest wit, we should meet you again in the near future. Good luck and geek speed, Lee. Thank you, Team Loot Crate. Ba da ba da ba da da ba da 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 da. It's Sean Connery. It's Austin Powers. It's um. Uh, it's um. Uh, Nicholas Cage. Someone out there is gonna kill me. <laughs> uh, but yeah, let's see. The Mega Crate looks pretty nice. It came with a laptop and a really nice watch and a bag and stuff like that. Uh, let's see. So yeah, we got the shirt. We got that. We got the Mad Libs. We got the lanyard. We got the survival bracelet. Orphan Black comic book. Haven't heard of this awesome Canadian sci-fi series about a girl and her clone doppelgangers. Well, come read all about it with the exclusive Loot Crate cover variant of the very first issue of Orphan Black. Uh, the field notes, and that's it. So yeah, I'm going to I'm going to play around with the, the the coding on this and stuff. And oh, this is going to be fun. Uh, Mad Libs would be something fun to do in a live stream with like a you know like a group of people. Maybe not this Mad Libs. Maybe if they have Mad Libs online or something, I think they probably should. This watch is so cool. Just. Ba -da, ba -da, ba -da -da. It's 10:51, guys. Even though my watch says 127, it's actually 122 because my watch is five minutes fast, or maybe it's two and a half hours fast, three and a half hours. You never know. And uh, <laughs> it was stirred. Oh God. So yeah, that's it for the Loot Crate. Um, if you want to subscribe to Loot Crate, if you're not already subscribed, there's a link in the description. Uh, if you follow that link and subscribe from there, I don't think if you click on the stuff at the top, like if you scroll down and go through the subscription thing that's on the page, um, then I will get a, uh, I will get a credit and you'll be able to get a few dollars off as well and everyone will be happy. So, um, if you subscribe, if you, if I referred you, so, um, yeah, I don't know what the theme for next month is yet, but it should be good. This is a very good loot crate. I do agree. I don't know if this is the best one, um, but it's definitely one of the best. I mean, I can't think of anything that had everything that I liked. I mean, aside from maybe the comic book, but like, this is cool. Despite the fact that I smell like a shoe store, this is useful. Despite the fact that it smells like a shoe store. The shirt is nice, the watch is really cool, and uh, the Mad Libs is just awesome. Just punched me right in the nostalgia. But anyway, this has been Several Total 4 with Loot Crate. I'll see you guys next month. Goodbye, everybody. Bye-bye.